Sutto. <laughs> I want to welcome you to the gateway of Sindh, Karachi's smaller cousin and a city overlooked by many tourists, but no more because today I have come to Hyderabad and I have come to explore it like never before. I think I've just found myself in the busiest place in the world. This is the Resham Gali in Hyderabad, one of the main markets in town. And this is crazy intense. There's people everywhere. You can barely get through. Apparently, there's kilometers upon kilometers of this market here. So it continues forever. I'm probably not going to test that hypothesis, but I see so much cool stuff all around me. So I can't wait to get exploring and do a bit of shopping. <laughs> As any foreign traveller in Pakistan will tell you, and yes, that includes me, for us there is absolutely no resisting these bustling, beautiful markets. These are little baby Mendy dresses for weddings. Just look at this. Sometimes I wish I was here again. Or at least that I had like a baby sister. Alas, I guess these will have to be left to people who will actually use them. So cute! Trust me, I could have stayed there all day and watched these pretty glistening little dresses. But even more interesting was to see how they are actually made by the tailors who occupy the back streets of the market. All of these things are made by hand from scratch. Isn't that amazing? But soon enough, we were pulled back into the streets of the market. I've just found something really cool and apparently very Cindy as well. These waistcoats. Which one should I get? This one? Is it Acha? I've just gone to look for a waistcoat just for me. Oh wow! Look at that! Look at this one! Yeah, wow! You know, it always starts with just one. How do you say stylish in Cindy? Sutto. <laughs> Sutto. Needless to say, I felt pretty Sutto in all of these. Wait, what? I think we got ourselves some paparazzi, but we also got something else. And I got a cup of chai. Look at that. Shukriya. Bahut shukriya. How do you say uh, thank you in Cindy? Shukriya in Cindy? Cindy me a shukriya. A shukriya. Cheers to my first chai in Hyderabad. Pretty much anywhere you are in the world, chai gives you that chance to sit back, relax, and watch the crowd go by. But in Hyderabad, that crowd sucks you right back in. Now this place is so crazy busy, I have no idea where I'm actually going. I am not even joking, this crowd was crazier than anything I'd ever experienced even in Karachi. But with Jazz Super 4G, I quickly managed to find my way out of the market and towards my next destination. Found it! Let's go! To me, this is the best thing about visiting any new city. Looking at the architecture, people watching, and ultimately finding your way to your destination. Even when it gets dark here in Hyderabad, the intensity does not subside at all. I feel actually it gets more intense with all the motorbike lights flashing at me. I have no idea where I'm walking. But I think, I think, I think I have found an oasis in all this madness. And that oasis is the most hotly recommended rubbery place in town. Actually, all of Pakistan, Haji Rabri. I believe that these are all for me, right? 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 All for me? This is the rubbery that pretty much everybody who's sent me recommendations about Hyderabad has said I need to try. This one is pistachio. This is the original. 
I'm gonna go with this flavor first. Now I have had rabri before once in Karachi and I com I loved it. So I'm just gonna see if this matches up to what I had there. I don't know. I don't know if it can. Hello. Oh yeah. <laughs> This is, this, guys, this is literally, I'm not kidding, I'm not exaggerating, this is literally the best dessert I've had in Pakistan. Hyderabad, you're good to me. <laughs> because Hyderabad kept on surprising me, I thought I would give a small little surprise in return. I have come to Adaba in order to learn a little bit of Sindhi. So this lovely Daba owner has offered to teach me a little bit of his local language. <laughs> Shukriya, Shukriya. Since we're having a cup of chai, Mujhe egg cup chai do de. I think that's, I would like a cup of tea, please. In Sindhi? Okay, okay, little cup of chai. Okay. I'm so bad at this. Okay. Easy. There's another phrase that if you're a traveler, you will probably use all the time. And I use all the time actually in Urdu. How do you say chalo in Sindhi? Hello. 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 Chalo. Hello. 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 It's the same. Okay, hello, hello. <laughs> and so I hallowed to the next spot. I don't know what it is about Hyderabad, but it seems that the people here have a really, really sweet tooth. Because another place that everybody told me to visit is called the Bombay Bakery. And it's famous for all of its cakes, especially a famous coffee cake. But having come here, I just realized that there is a ridiculously large and long queue. People are telling me that this queue will take about at least 30 minutes to actually scatter. I mean, is it really worth the hype? I guess we have to wait. You know, I guess sometimes it pays to be a girl because I get to skip the gents queue and I get to go pretty much straight to the cakes that's called exclusive access there they are Yay. he's saying i should get the coffee cake or the chocolate cake but i don't really want to choose so i'll get both don't judge me can i have both there's almond cake too it's warm and your coffee, okay. and coffee cake. Warm and delicious. Is They're giving me an almond cake and a coffee cake, and they're just about to give me a chocolate cake as well. Hyderabad, I love you. <laughs> Guess how many cakes I would eventually walk out with? And I'm here to sample all of these. We've got two cakes right here. Three, four, five, six. Cake number one. Love it. The famous coffee cake of Bombay Bakery. This is what all the hype is about. I love coffee. This is perfect. You know, the thing about Bombay Bakery is that it's been around for like over a hundred years. That's um, you know much older than probably most food establishments in all of Pakistan. Pre-partition. I'm quite excited to be here and trying out their next cake. Very good. Mm -hmm. Three down, three to go. Fruit cake. We have these back home. Wow. Mm -hmm. Just like back home. Macaroon cake. You didn't see this. This is my favorite so far. Last cake. Here we have, obviously, a chocolate cake. 
an explosion of sweetness and chocolate in your mouth. Just look at them. They were still staring at me in all their glory and all of their deliciousness. But I am done. <laughs> and there we are, ladies and gentlemen. That was my experience of Hyderabad, a city that I found to be sweet and colorful and stylish and a city that I know I will never ever again compare to Karachi. A city that's actually taught me a lot about perspective. Hyderabad, I know I'll keep coming back.